Hi everyone. In this video, I will explain different types of modes like uh, pi, pi mode oscillations and uh, what is the cutoff voltage and RT condition for this magnetron oscillator. So in the previous video, I have explained about the magnetron oscillator operation with eight different cavities which are used to um, produce oscillations with the number of oscillations inside because of the anode, cathode and the anode so that the electron will move between the cathode and anode because of the magnetic field. When there is no magnetic field, the electron will be attracted by the anode from the cathode and when the high amount of magnetic field came into existence, when the force is exerted, some force is exerted on that electron so that the electron will be repelled back towards the cathode. Okay, so now first let us see in this uh, video, I will explain about uh, pi mode oscillations. So pi mode oscillations, pi mode pi mode oscillations. Let the cavity magnetron let the cavity let the cavity magnetron has eight cavities eight cavities these are resonant cavities eight different cavities which are used for producing resonance by which it supports variety of modes varieties of modes depending upon depending upon the phase difference between The phase difference between fields in two adjacent cavities. Two adjacent cavities. See here what is he is saying is let the cavity magnetron has eight cavities already we have seen the diagram with eight different cavities by which it supports varieties of modes depending upon the phase difference between the fields in the two adjacent cavities okay between two adjacent cavities the field uh, it gives the different types of oscillations okay so Boundary conditions are boundary conditions are satisfied when satisfied when the total phase the total phase shift around the eight cavities around the eight cavities is multiplied by is multiplied by two pi radians two pi radians However, the most important mode, the most important mode for magnetron operation is one where 
in the phase shift between phase shift between the fields of fields of adjacent cavities adjacent cavities is pi radians this is what the important mode in the operation of the magnetron oscillator so in fact this is known as this is known as pi mode this mode is known as pi mode see however the most important mode for the magnetron oscillator is one where in the phase shift between the fields of adjacent cavities which is nothing but we can say it is a pi mode coming to hull cutoff voltage and hearty condition so hull cutoff voltage and RT condition I'll cut off voltage and RT condition so in cylindrical magnetron in cylindrical Magnetron, several reentrant cavities, several reentrant cavities are connected to the gaps. Are connected to the gaps. So in cylindrical magnetron, the structure of the reentrant cavities, how it will be? All these reentrant cavities which are connected together through a gap. Thus, it is also known as klystron cavity magnetron. Hence, it is also known as This is also known as cavity magnetron. Cavity magnetron because there is this some cavity between them. The D, uh, assume that the radius of the cathode is A. Assume that. The radius of the cathode is A and the radius of anode which is higher anode is B the DC voltage V naught the DC voltage V naught is applied between the cathode and the anode when the DC voltage and the magnetic flux are adjusted properly when the DC voltage
and the magnetic flux that is which is in the positive z direction magnetic flux which is in the positive z direction positive z direction are adjusted properly the electrons will flow the electrons will follow parabolic path parabolic path in the presence of in the presence of cross field in the presence of cross field so these parabolic paths are formed these parabolic paths are formed in the cathode anode space in the cathode anode space under the combined force under the combined force of both electric and magnetic fields which are perpendicular to each other which are perpendicular to each other okay see this uh, pi mode oscillations and this uh, hull cut off voltage and heart rate conditions this is somewhat theory so how these pi radiations and the pi mode is occurring how the radius and radius of the anode and cathode and how the electron path is existing and how the magnetic field is going to attract the electron so that how the electrons are being reflected back to the cathode and how the parabolic projections is taking place when the magnetic field is occurring so all these the theoretical part just i have explained and written parallelly okay so in the examinations also if you are asked to come uh, explain about the pi mode oscillations and the hearty and the hull cut off just you need to write this theory part okay thank you